Hello friends and knife nerds. This is a closer look at the Brissa PK70FX. This is a very nice small EDC fixed blade. I know there are many of you who prefer fixed blades out there and I think this knife may interest you. It's uh, really well made. Just the fit and finish on this fixed blade are evident by looking at it as you take a tour around it. Brissa has been in business for a, a while and they are, uh, they are impressive. Their knives are impressive. This is no exception. The blue jeans micarta on this is so cool looking. The different layers there and uh, I mean the comfort and the smoothness of this micarta is just amazing. I haven't really felt micarta this smooth the way they finished it and uh feels great it's very cool and uh this knife has uh, been a friendly user for me i uh, definitely need to maybe clean it in between uses a little bit because i use it for food prep and then i'll go do some yard tests and who knows what i'm slicing open out there but this thing has worked for all of it really simply made minimalist design and uh just beautiful for those of you that love a scandy grind here it is we have a big, chunky, one-eighth inch thick blade, and the Scandi grind it brings the edge down to a razor sharpness. Really nice. We have 12C27 steel on this. Nice stainless steel. And uh, I was impressed. I mean, the ergonomics, you can see as you grab it, I have big hands. It doesn't fully come to the back of my hand, but uh, I don't need it to necessarily. Um, when I come for the overhand, for the precise cuts, really feels nice and comfortable. When I grab it, just to grab it, like I'm carrying it, it's uh, very comfortable. And uh, really, for poking as well, very comfortable. So, let's check out some of the, uh, some of the facts about this knife. Now, I got measurements that were in millimeters. But uh, let's check out the American measurements here. This knife is, oh, okay, it's just a hair over six and a quarter inches. That is a, that is a very small EDC. And the blade itself, let's see, what do we got? The blade is just about two and three quarter inches. Okay. Well, so two and three quarter inch blade, a three and almost three and a half inch handle is just about six and a quarter inches worth of knife overall. Please don't do that math because I probably didn't add together perfectly. So one more look at the fit and finish here. I just, uh, that's one of the things that really impressed me here with Brissa. It, it's just as good as anything I've seen on a knife lanyard hole in case that's your thing and a beautiful genuine leather case they did not they did not skimp on the case this isn't that rough leather that you get with uh, cheaper thieves you know what i'm talking about it's all dried out and you know very hairy and dry this is nice and it smells as soon as you open the box you smell that genuine leather so i'm a big fan of that um uh, just always nice to get something that feels good on the side of your hip. You know what I mean? Not just something. Sometimes that rigid thing on your hip can just constantly remind you what's there. If you have something made of leather, it can rest easier in my experience on your hip, which I prefer personally. But uh, this is a very impressive knife, and I really want to know what it weighs. This, uh, let's see here. Zero that out. 2.67, 2.67 ounces. Wow, that is nice and light. This is really a beautiful little fixed blade that if you're looking for something small but rugged for just on your hip, everyday tasks, you can't go wrong making uh, the PK70FX your decision.